Matthew 7 verse 12. In everything then, do to others as you would have them do to you. For this is the essence of the law and the prophets. Loving Jesus, as we contemplate the sacrifices that you have made on Calvary's cross for us, we just want to pause to say thank you for all that you are to us and praise your holy name for all that you have done for us and all that you are going to do for us in the days that lie ahead. Lord, we know that we are not worthy to undo your shoes laces and yet you have lifted us up out of the merry clay and set our feet on solid holy ground. What a good and gracious God you are. Father, we simply want to surrender all that we are to you and offer our lives as a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable to you. For you have saved us from the pit of destruction and clothed us in the righteousness of Christ. You have brought us into your own heavenly family and reserve us an inheritance in heaven that will never fade away. You alone are worthy of our praise and love and we surrender all we are to you this moment and pray that your will not mine be carried out in my life from this day forward even forevermore in Jesus name I pray. Amen. Some of these truths, but I thought it'll be good to read it. You know, it's somebody, it's, it's not written by me, someone, I read this somewhere. He says, there's some things I've learned in life. It'll just take a few minutes. <clears throat> I've learned that certificates that hang on your wall do not make you a decent human being. It just shows how much education you got. That sometimes it's very hard to determine where to draw the line between being nice and not hurting people's feelings and at the same time standing up for what you believe that's not easy All but kind, gracious, it's heaven, something Father, we have to learn if at this moment, we want to and the other we thing is you know people who are very adamant about their about particular position the no matter how thin you, you slice it there are always two sides. Remember that. There's your side and the other side that you don't see. No matter how much I care for people, there will always be some people who will not care about it. Just accept that as a fact. And remember this, it's a lot easier to react than it is to think. And then decide what to do. I've also learned that it takes many years to build up trust in someone. And it only takes a few seconds to destroy it. There's something you do. And I've also learned that it's not what you have in your life, but who you have in your life. It really matters. I've also learned that you cannot make someone love you. Everything I need is my and I've also learned that you can get by with your smartness for about 10 minutes, but after that you better know something. Jesus is for 10 minutes, okay. Closer than a brother, my Jesus is for me. Closer than a brother, my Jesus is for me. I've learned that it takes a long time to become the person that I really want to be. So don't get discouraged. I've learned that you must always leave your loved ones with loving words. I've also learned that you can still keep going for a long time, even after you think that you can't go on. I've learned that we are responsible for what we do, no matter how we feel. Either you control your attitude, I've learned 
that the amount of money you have is a lousy way of thinking how you do it. Power, in power, You never tell a child Why that its dreams are unlikely to When you can pray to the dream and accomplish something that you love, then he will lead away. Your biological family won't always be there to help you. There are others in our church who will be closer to you than me. When you can pray, and no matter how much you are grieving over something, remember the world is not going to stop. We shall have a grand time, walking with the Lord. I've also learned that our background, and our traditions, and our circumstances may have influenced who we are. We are responsible for what we are doing. I've learned that two people can look at the same thing and see something completely different in it. And I've also learned that the background in which we live is not what is, is not all that is offered to us. We can change it. And no matter how fast or how far you go away, you can't outrun God. He'll still get you. And no matter how far away I've gone, he's always waiting to welcome me back. And I also learned that if you do the right thing for the wrong reason, it's still wrong. Love is not for me to keep, but to pass on to the next person I see. And finally, even if you live the most perfect life on earth, there'll always be somebody to find fault with you. So don't get discouraged. <laughs> Jesus walked this way. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, it's a wonderful life that you've called us to. Help us to believe in it and to live that life where we are always, by grace, saved through faith. In Jesus' name, Amen. Our kind, gracious Heavenly Father, what in heaven. If at this moment we want to tell you thanks for life, we want to tell you thanks for your grace and your mercy. As you are about to sing song to the honor and glory of your name, I pray for you to lead and direct us. In Jesus' holy precious name I pray. Amen. Amen. I'm going to sing until the power of the Lord come down. I'm going to sing until the power of the Lord come down. Lift up your head. Don't be afraid. I'm going to sing until the power of the Lord come down. He gave us a victory. Many people doubt him, but I can't do without him. That is why I love him so. He's so real to me. Closer than a brother, my Jesus is to me. He's my dearest friend in everything I need. He is my rock. And I did play closer than a brother, Jesus is to me. One more time, closer than a brother, my Jesus is to me. He's my dearest friend in everything I need. He is my rock, my shield, and I did play. Closer than a brother, Jesus is to me. There is power, power, wonder, power in the 